Finally on to two tonight, we hear from a woman who says a West Tulsa pastor and community center director embezzled nearly $1 million from the organization on her watch. Today, a federal judge sentenced Willard Jones to three years in prison. Two News reporter Liz Bryant's been on this story since it broke. What's the latest on the community center? Liz. Well, Stephen, Greater Cornerstone Community Center on the brink of destruction is how the board president describes the situation. With no, with no money and no donors, the uh, Tulsa Community Foundation is actually about to step in and build a whole new board. One, two, three. Defenders! The basketball court is full tonight because the bank account of Cornerstone Community Center is not. He was such a good con artist. Shannon McMurray, the board president, admits founder 63-year-old Willer Jones stole a million dollars under her watchful eye. She and Jones built the center from the ground up since 2006. He, you know what he's sorry for? He got caught. I mean, that's what I told the judge. I was like, you know, acceptance of responsibility is an important part of your consideration, and I anticipate he's going to get up here and, you know, be sorry, sorry, sorry. But let me just tell you, he did nothing to assist. He mentioned during his sentencing today that he was like Jekyll and Hyde in terms of his personality. The U.S. attorney says Jones asked all different philanthropies for money for the center, then used it to gamble, buy a Rolex watch, fur coats, booze, and renovate his home. Because he was such a driving force in, in, in raising the money that, uh, that the board acquiesced now that they look back on it too much. As for Shannon, the last time she ever talked to Willard, she demanded bank records. Shannon says he wrapped board members around his finger and admits there weren't enough checks and balances. You wouldn't believe how I defied that board. We, it was a fractioned friction because it was all these church people, which was so much, you learn so much through these things, like such a conflict of interest. I didn't, I mean, I loved Willard, but I could see the forest past the trees. <laughs> For now, Cornerstone is hosting basketball games to keep money coming in. That's until a new board can regain the trust of donors. Now, after Jones spends 37 months in prison, he'll be on three years of supervised um, release, and he'll also have to pay a million in restitution. McMurray said when the judge told him, you are going behind bars today, he pretended to faint. Live right now, Liz Bryant, 2 News, works for you.